Hey guys, what's going on? Promot Sin, I'm back with another video. And I have actually been, I'm kind of proud of myself. I've been doing a lot of videos lately, and I've been uh, staying on, on top of trying to do at least one video a day until Black Ops releases. Uh, right now it is 17 days until Black Ops 2, and so I think I'm going to have to post uh, two videos on it, or two videos a day at maybe two days, maybe three, I'm not sure. I, I still have to uh, get my desktop back up and running so that I can get the gameplays off of there. Uh, this gameplay is a very, sh it's a very um, long Moab, I think it's like a five minute Moab or something like that, but I was playing solo. And these guys were playing pretty campy, uh, as you'll see a few times in this gameplay. Um, I'll be running over to this area, and there'll be more than one portable radar. And uh, <clears throat> and it's actually kind of funny, is this flawless 1231 guy, he rages as, almost as much as I do. You can hear him get very upset every time I kill him. And I, I think... I kill him maybe five times in this whole streak, maybe six, I'm not too sure. So he contributed a fair amount of uh, of his deaths to my Moab streak. And I only go on like a 30 gun streak. And I get killed by the flawless guys. He's uh, camping on top of the pipe with a Type 95. So it's a hell of a way to end the streak. But anyways, what I want to talk about this commentary is finding something that you love to do and making sure that you have time to do it. Um, something that I found in my adult life that helps keep your sanity with all the, you know, the stuff that life likes to throw at you is I like to try to find something that I just love to do that helps take my mind off of things and I don't really have to worry about, you know, anything outside of that for that short amount of time. And I like to try to, you know, do that, but not to an excessive amount. And what I mean by that is everything is good in moderation. You don't want to, you know, do too much of anything. I mean, even drinking too much water can kill you. So obviously you don't, you know, there is a limit to how much you should participate in something or, you know, actively do something. So like a few things that I like to do is for one, I like to play Call of Duty, you know, and this, this YouTube thing, I'm still, you know, learning, you know, some of the, the, the inner workings of it, if you will. And you know, still getting my groove, like, where I can just sit down and just pop out a commentary. Like, this commentary, I had to sit down and think about for probably about 20 minutes to half hour to figure out what I wanted to talk about. But, you know, some of the other things I like to do is, it, you know, I, I'm an, I'm not really a, a nerdy person, I would say. I just have nerdy tendencies. Let, let, let's put it that way. Uh, but I like to play a trading card game called Magic the Gathering. And I'm sure some of you more in my age group have heard of it, but I'm sure that some of the younger people, you know, like uh, still in middle school or in high school haven't heard of it. But uh, it's kind of hard to explain, and I don't really want to, you know, spend too much of this commentary just talking about that. But it's a very fun card game that you can play with your friends. Uh, yes, it does get quite expensive. Um, you know, but it's it's a fun hobby. Uh, and I, and quite a few of my friends play it. I recently got my girlfriend into playing it, so that's always fun because that way, her uh, her and I can spend some time together doing something that we both enjoy doing. Uh, another thing is Call of Duty. I've talked about this before. She's she's pretty awesome about you know willing to play video games with me. Uh, so it you know it's nice to be able to have some hobbies that I don't have to sacrifice a lot of my personal life to. Uh, to actually like participate in um, you know playing video games and playing magic and hanging out with my friends are really the only things I do that I wouldn't really consider productive like towards my overall life but you know luckily my girlfriend is willing to do all three of those things with me so I don't have to you know sacrifice more of my personal life with her to have uh, some fun real quick but, you know, th that's it's just something that I find really important is to find something that you enjoy doing in your life. To, you know, just to, to de-stress and stuff like that. And this game is not a very good example of de-stressing, as you see right there. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the commentary. Leave a comment below on what you guys like to do, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.